So um, here we have our basic house. Um, I'm going to teach you how to put trim on this house. So what we're going to do first, um, select this point over here and we want to shift S to snap our cursor to selection. And this will help us to make our trim from the side view. We're going to add um, a Bezier curve. Um, it's not in the right plane. Rotate Z90, Y90. Now from here just make um, the outline of your trim. Um, because we have this cursor right at that point, we can actually select our point and snap it to our cursor, making sure that our house lines up with itself. Um, if you hit W, you can cut it, uh, cut a segment in half, and add a segment in between. Won't really talk too much about actually how to model the molding because that's up to you. So now you have this nice little molding, and you want to put it around your house. Um, again, since I moved my cursor, we want to snap our cursor to selection. Um, and now we're going to add in another Bezier curve. But the first thing we're going to do is we're going to change it to poly, and we're going to delete all but four dots. So one, two, three, four. To get these to align, I'm going to use the same um, snapping the cursor to the selection and then the selection to the cursor method. And now that we have our our line, the last step we're going to do, we're just going to type in, uh, we're going to select this and hit um, C to close that line. So now we have one line running across, uh, running around the whole edge of the house. And um, I'm going to select my trim now. I'm going to name it trim. And that edge that we selected in bevel object we're gonna just type in trim now you'll see it goes around the whole house um, there's a couple problems we want to turn off back and front and then we want to go in the curve and hit W switch direction or rotate X 90 just play with it until your curve lines up how it is supposed to
then that's basically how you do the molding. Um, the normals right now are actually um, on the wrong side, but you can get rid of that once you convert it to a polygon using Alt C, and there you see that your normals are now on the right side. And that's basically how you create trim or molding um, in Blender.